Oh, mate, he just <laughs> nailed his head. Oh, wow. You all right? Do you want to cuddle? Oh, the eggs. The eggs. Why one? Yeah. Oh, the eggs. The eggs. Oh, the eggs. The eggs. The eggs. The eggs. Hi. Yeah. We're oh, road trip. my God. So today we're answering your questions from Twitter. Tell them Andy. Twitter at Road Trip TV. He knows. So um, we've got about 21 questions from all of you with the hashtag take this home, which is... 21 questions to go. <laughs> 21 <laughs> questions to go. To be like, let me know. Sexy vegan. Sexy vegan. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's that, bro? <laughs> That's take this home. And that's coming out on the 4th of August. But guys, that's our new single. Make sure you go and download it. Tell all your friends. And uh, thank you for all your questions. We're going to play them now. Uh, unfortunately, when we did this and saved these videos, we didn't save the names of anyone. So we're not entirely sure on everyone's name, but we've at least got the video. You need help. First question. My question is, if you could have any superpower in the world, what would it be? Love you guys, see you soon. Love you too, oh, love you too. So if we could have any superpower in the world, what would it be? Jack. Invisibility. Mikey. Flying. Chicks. I second that, mate. Yeah, third that and I like Chicks, 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 chicks. Second one, guys, is from this Who girl. knows? Oh, but this one's slightly harder because she, although she sent in a lovely video with a cute little wink, she there's no audio really. We have to read this one out. What <laughs> is the funniest thing one of you have ever done? Also, also I love you so much. Kiss, kiss, Aww, kiss. Bless. Thank you, sweetheart. What's, um, the what's the funniest thing you've ever done? I reckon cacking Brooklyn in the last video. Oh, my no, was up there. What's the, the funniest thing? thing I think the funniest thing you've ever done is drop watermelon, and I, no one was there. It for was it, so it was... weird. It was just me and him and Casey. <laughs> it was only like through yeah. it. It was. It's, I had a plate of watermelon, tried to put it on the side, and went. And then like it stayed there and then just all it's, collapsed it, off. it floated. That watermelon floated for a moment in time. Oh, way back from Glasgow. When you started crying, that had me and Peter. Oh, yeah. oh, so you lying. made him laugh so much that you found him funny. <laughs> that was the most I've ever laughed at Jack. But Jack wow. No no Amsterdam. Amsterdam being sick. Oh, I'm standing Oh, with sick. Charlie, yeah. Oh, oh, but with Charlie, we want you Jack again. had him under his thumb the whole time. Every time Charlie spoke, Jack would go, go do a demonstration. <laughs> you ready? Hey, I'm Charlie. <laughs> Yeah, I'm Jack, 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 stop. Jack, stop. Jack, stop. And if you know Charlie, Charlie likes getting aggressive. <laughs> Charlie was getting very wound up by um by by Jack. <laughs> um, Brooklyn, what's the funniest thing you've ever done? Okay, moving on. Mikey, what's the funniest thing you've ever done? What's so great? What's about so great about her? Brooke was talking about his great nan. <laughs> so I so I said, oh, is she good is she? Thinking that like it was quite subtle, and Mikey just straight up went, yeah. What's so great about her? And I that was on trial at the time, and it was the most of ever. Was, that's we, why we got him in. Yeah, that's the only reason was. he's in. Honestly, what's so great about it was the reason I'm in the band. Funniest thing you ever did. Here we go. Oh. Ever. Mm -hmm. Get on with it. When, at that time, when, um, <laughs> <laughs> do you remember when, do you remember Blair said that thing and you were like, oh, that thing, and everyone laughed. You don't find it funny, do you? No, I do. There yeah. was that other time as well. That they can't know about, so I can't tell that one either. Which one was that? When you first bumped it? Yeah. That, yeah. that was, was that funny. Time. Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't want to get too big. I don't want to get too big. <laughs> <laughs> Your funniest moment was replicating another funny moment from a film. Anyway. Now, Andy's a funny guy. It's just hard to pick from so many. My question is, what has been your favourite tour? Mine was definitely the Christmas tour when I got to meet you. I second that. I think it's this one. <laughs> so. If this goes out quickly, then we're still on it. If, we it, are. if it doesn't, we enjoyed right. it. Yeah, we did. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the Take This Home tour was awesome. Summertime tour. Summertime ball tour was awesome. <laughs> summertime ball. Summertime ball. ball. I don't know can... why it's called summertime. Boys it should be called Take This we Home. We don't pick the names of the tours. Yeah, why don't we? Oh, oh. As in, you know. Why don't we Acronym. pick them? Honestly, the names of the tours aren't our responsibility, so if you hate on them, you don't hate us. Yeah. Chill. It's chill. It was we be we called... hate them more than you do. Oh, yeah. We battle them so hard. You should have seen what it would have been called. Pajama party! Where kids come and play! <laughs> Everyone turn up in your PJs, that's PG. My question is, what do you hope to achieve in the next five years? Love you. What do we hope to achieve in the next five years? Brooklyn! I reckon the best thing you could achieve in the next five years, losing a bit of that. Do you know what you could do? And you could lose some arrogance. What do you reckon he would be in like five years? <laughs> In the world's most successful boy band of all time. There is Ju that. Just about. Yeah. Like, that's that's not going to be his best thing. No, his best thing. Oh, 
We all know his best thing's gonna be. Don't we, Mike? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We don't have anything, we're just making We don't, yeah. Brooke's still gonna be here, and that's what's the best Even if the band isn't, Brooke will still be here. Brooke will still be in this flat. We'll live here. As long as you're still playing guitar, you're still being a G, <laughs> you'll be good. <laughs> Mikey, where do you wanna be in five years? We'll be married. I bet he's the kind of guy that wants to be married in five years. Where do you wanna be in five years, Andy? Oh, I'm gonna change the question. It's where would we be in five years if the band wasn't a thing? I think oh. you'd be flipping. Flipping! You'd be flipping, but burgers. Be flipping you'd burgers. be flipping bodies, you'd be flipping burgers, you'd be flipping amazing. Flipping hilarious. Yeah, mate. you'd be flipping hilarious. <laughs> yeah. And you'd be flipping mental. Yeah. And I'd be flipping. <laughs> flipping and I'd be flat. flipping flat. No. Yeah, so yeah, I'd um... be flipping broke. Hi, I was wondering if you were ever gonna come to Devon, which is like six hours away from London. Love you boys so much. Love you too! Next next question. Question. Uh, Devon's, next. Devon's quite close to where I live. We've all been there. We yeah. don't discriminate against counties. We'll That's probably nice. pass through Devon soon when we go camping in Cornwall. Would you rather be a tree or a table? That's my question. That's my question. Uh. <laughs> 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 you know, she <laughs> Anna. I went like I went like this, and I was like, "Oh, my face is a bit close to hers." I was like, I'll "Lick that." Sorry, Anna. <laughs> Where do we do we want to be trees, guys? That's the question. Trees or tables? tables? Can what tables wait? What if you decide to be a tree, and then your worst nope. nightmare comes to life when someone turns you into a table? And a bird has a family in me. Bird has a family. A tree. That really ran through a me. Tree <laughs> it's like the table. polar opposite of what it's meant to be, isn't it? A bird had a family in me. A I mean, I don't know about you guys, tree. but think about it this way: I'd rather be a tree if it was just a generic table. Yeah. But if you, what if you were the table? In the, the, the White House, or in the, or in the, and you could hear all those conversations. Ah, uh, yeah, that'd, that'd be, be pretty cool. cool. Philip, I had my first poo in ten years today. Guys, here we go. Oh, it's an international roadie. This is from Italia. What's your biggest fear? What's your <laughs> biggest fear? <laughs> Brooklyn, what's your biggest fear? Probably heights, right? Heights and spiders. Yeah, what about a tall spider? What about you stood on top of a cliff <laughs> overlooking a massive pool of spiders? <laughs> well, With your only way down. Oh, shoot them up! My biggest fear is <laughs> Brooklyn half the time. <laughs> <laughs> Brooke at that. How yeah. are you not scared of that? That's a scary person. What is your biggest fear? Halloumi. Um, <laughs> <laughs> your biggest fear is Halloumi. <laughs> I'm scared of being so alone. Aww. Aww. Next question! Next question! Do you guys watch every single reaction? on YouTube to your covers and vlogs, and if so, please go check out my channel, Rise Sunshine. Sunshine. Aww. I have, Rise Rise Sunshine. Sunshine. I have actually watched your videos, and yeah, I'm pretty yeah. sure Andy has yeah, as well. Yeah. Right. We have three very avid watchers of reaction videos. We have Jack, we have Mikey, we have Andy. I love a good reaction! Um, but, uh, but yeah, no, we do. We all watch reaction videos, they're pretty dope, but Andy's probably the first to pick up on them, and then he'll be like, have you seen this from Jamaica, and we'll be like, that's sick. We haven't had any reaction videos from Jamaica yet, so any Jamaican roadies watching, I'd love to see it. Okay. What's the worst thing about living in a flat as a by-band and with Harvey? So what's the worst thing about living together in a flat with Harry? Worst thing about living with... You share with Harvey, you do half. What's the worst thing about the living with The worst thing about living with Harvey, he buys clothes oh, and that. gives them to me because he never wears them again. That's awful, that. Or, or, or in the first place, he doesn't wear them at all. I hate living with you, so... Aww. Oh, I was... Yeah, you're meant to bite back, otherwise I was like a bully. You are! You're I'm the joking. big B. You're the big, big B. B! What's the worst thing about living with Brooklyn, Andy? Gone. Not just Brooklyn, I actually don't mind living with Brooklyn. What about Jack? Yeah. Oh god. That's annoying, isn't it? I don't like living with anyone. I'm I'm a solitude kind of guy. Would you guy. rather live under a rock? Yeah. Because then I could keep my rock tidy. That's true. Lack of admitting to washing up. Oh, He's actually that? got some washing up in the sink right now. Who is that? Have you ever been to Europe on your own? Oh, this is from a Swiss roadie. I know that for a fact because it's right there. Swiss roadies, thank you very much. And will we tour Europe on our own? Good question. Answer it. Blair. Probably not. I don't really like him. Thanks, Blair. Thanks, Blair. <laughs> Cheers, pal. No, we will, guys. Of course, we'll come to Europe on our own. Like, it's going to be dope. <gasps> oh, rep in the hoodie. I just wanted to know what your guys' favourite part of being on tour is. And also your least favourite part. Love you, bye! Good bye. question! What about Naomi Good in the question. moment? You smashed it! Naomi, you've been a winner. Most favourite, least favourite. You're your most favourite part of tour? Yes. I respect it. Thanks, man. Most favourite part of tour is promoting the new music and seeing people's reaction yeah. to it. To be fair, this tour choreography has been oh, the best yeah, part, it's isn't it? Sick. Oh, we just send it.
<laughs> We're awesome. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Uh, what's your worst, <laughs> best part of tour, Mike? Lack of sleep, isn't it? That's yeah, tiredness. Yeah. That's probably the worst part. Yeah, traveling to a proper tells, Oh my god, I'm my least favorite part of touring is getting to venues eight hours early. So that, yeah, so yeah. That we sit around yeah, yeah. and watch oh, the whole show. Darren, uh, get the venue three hours early and being like, "Oh no, you got to sit around, boys." Mm. He is nice though. He's a lovely guy. Just yeah. Get... Cheers, Darren. You yeah. work hard, but can you make us not work as hard? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Chicks. Yeah. Chicks. Yep. Chicks. Yep. Chicks. Yeah. And Darren. And Darren. Nice. Strong, strong six. That's strong. good. What is your favorite thing you've ever done as a band, and why? But can you answer that? Go on. I reckon America and Amsterdam. Jack, you answer, go on. Everything we do. Wow! That was a question. What do you reckon the best thing we've done as a band is, Andy? Hired Alex. D hired Elvis. Oh, yeah. Elvis. My favourite thing that we've done as a band was probably played at Wembley four times. Moving out of yes. Blair's place. Moving out from Woman Dad's head. Moving out from Blair's and Ginger's was the best thing we've ever done. It tops anything. Hey guys, so what's the best slash most memorable slash favourite um, gift that you've ever received off of a fan on top? Received. Gift that we've ever received. Yeah, I got two gifts from a girl called Crystal. Uh, Newton Fulton signed photo and a JP Cooper signed album. And I was like, I love that you know that I oh, like those yeah. things. Uh, Jack, what's your best gift you've ever had? Other than obviously the entry to the band. That was a gift, wasn't it? We were, we were giving that away. We were. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever got that first. Free. Whoever got that first got it. It was really. cheap at the time. It was in more counter. We got a pretty nifty um, toilet golf set. That you like to use? I do! <laughs> I love my toilet golf. Do like toilet. I don't like to play it conventional though. If you asked us this a time ago, we'd have all said Doug, I reckon. Doug was one of the best gifts of the time. No, now dead. Blair hurt Doug, uh, and Doug doesn't exist anymore. We also, we've gotten given, we got given a map once, and I don't know what we ever did with it. Jack's oh, out in his room. We got well, even a map. Brock has it. I do have it. What is it? What is it? Again? Just you just scratch it off. It's a scratch off map. Oh yeah, that was it. That's sick. So That's cool. we got given a map. That you you open up, you stick it on your wall, right? And then crazy thing, you literally get your finger out, even more mental fingers, and then you stick it on the map. If you think well, you can't see what what the world is, so like when you go into it, you then <laughs> shirts. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you used sick. to get a load of Reese's pieces. That's died. You used to get a load of Head and Shoulders. That's really died. Yeah, I'm afraid so. Joel, we've all been given some sick clothes. Yeah. Genuinely, yeah, we've yeah. been Genuinely. given some dope T-shirts, hoodies, hats. <clears throat> Shoes, we love stuff like that. Legit, thank you for all of your gifts. Like, we don't necessarily ask you guys to bring anything at all, but we appreciate when you do, so legit. And the biggest gift you could give us is a follow on Instagram. What's your favourite song to sing on tour? Take this home. Take this After home. After the show. After the show, to be fair. No, take this home. Take this home. Best song. It's out now. Go get it. You won't regret it. It's going to change Go everything. Get her. If you ever got the opportunity to win, or you probably will, get the opportunity to do a world tour, where would be the first place, collectively as a band, you would choose to go? We all answer together. Three, two, one. No! North Jersey. Jersey. Where did everyone say individually now? Norfolk. New, New Jersey. Right. Amsterdam. Manchester. Dublin. Lovely. Who in the band watches Love Island? Ooh! Funny you say that because we're on it! Yo, yo, yo! Shameless plug for the fact that we did a vlog saying that we were going on it. You can find that in the description. Yeah. Yep. We have no shame here at Road Trip. We'll do anything. We're not embarrassed. I, I don't watch Blatantly. it. Blatantly. You do watch Love Island, don't you? Brooke and I do, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think they're the only two that do. Uh, the rest of us wish we were... Wish, wish I we wish could, I wish I had the I wish I had the brain to watch it. Yeah, I agree. Right, I'm gonna be very brutal about right why I watch Love Island. Cool. One, to keep up to date with the news, so that everyone's talking about it, you know what's going on. Two, because there's actually intellect in watching nonsense television because it like helps your mind right. We have an episode two of Love Island coming out next week. Do if we, we actually do, that'd be sick. Yeah, if we I don't, know. don't put that in. Yeah. Do we actually El oh, wait, Elvis, do you wanna do an episode two? No. Alright, we won't do oh, one then. Oh, shut up. Guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you leave a big thumbs up. Comment any questions you got for the, our next Q&A. <laughs> thanks Down for your questions. See you on the flip side. You Subscribe. Are. Peace. When life doesn't give you lemons, just keep looking. Welcome to Road Trip.